Hey everyone, it's Tamiqua. It's time to measure for your flange size. Okay, so for today's purpose, I'm gonna be using this demo breast or chest. Here's what I want you to know. This is a really tiny nipple, okay? And it's fine, nipples come in a degree of shapes and sizes, so we wanna make sure that you are using the right one for you. So. Think about this as your Goldilocks moment, okay? I took my kids to see Puss in Boots a few weekends ago and I was like, oh my God. So here we go. Out of the box, your pump comes with a 24. Now this is your nipple, this is a 24. This is clearly the wrong size, but what happens is that most of us are using this when we shouldn't be. Why? Because it came with it, right? And some of us aren't aware that we should be sizing it. So clearly, if this is your nipple size and you're using the 24, which is the a flange right out of the box, it is going to pull not only your nipple, but your entire areola into the flange. We do not want that. It can cause um, nipple damage, trauma, as well as cause a reduction in your milk supply because it's not working the way it's supposed to. So think about this as your Goldilocks moment and we're gonna find the right size for you. Ideally, we wanna leave one millimeter to three millimeters of space to allow for your nipple to swell. It's gonna swell just a little bit during pumping, but it shouldn't be anything drastic if you're using the correct flange size. So we're gonna start with the 14. This is still a bit big. You want it to be able to go on and off comfortably without touching the sides. This is the 13. This is the 12. And this is the 11. So the 11 is gonna be too small. 12 or 13 would be my recommendation. 13 is honestly gonna be too big. So the 12 might be better. And what we would do in a flange consult we would test out both the 12 and the 13 to see which one was the best size for you. Now, today I'm using this milk ruler by Legendary Milk. However, there are other tools that are available to you. Um, so this I bought from their website. I do believe you can find it on Amazon, but you can also get something like this from your local craft store. You can check out Joann's or Michael's. They have circumference rulers that you can use just like this. If you have any questions, let me know below.